as we're coming from the Manial Palace, uh, the beautiful uh, complex built by Prince Mohammed Ali. And we have learned in the previous segment about its history. And uh, we're happy to have with us tour guide uh, Mrs. Helal Gandur to uh, tell us more about uh, this beautiful edifice. Welcome with us. Uh, it's a pleasure joining uh, Nile Coast. Thank you, thank you very much. And, uh, and could you please tell us, um, uh, um, Hela, uh, uh, in your view, uh, uh, about the historic uh, significance of this uh, palace? Uh, the whole, this is a great royal palace. Uh, it was built uh, in the late 19th century, uh, uh, early 20th, uh, and it uh, reflects the lifestyle and artifacts of uh, uh, that era. Um, it uh, commemorates and eternalizes the Islamic art. Uh, uh, it, it combines the, between the modern Islamic architecture and uh, the old Islamic uh, architecture, um, uh, carrying uh, the essence of uh, Moroccan, Persian, uh, and Syrian, uh, and, and various, and, uh, various uh, art, uh, Islamic arts. Yes. Yes, uh, indeed. And uh, when we look at this museum, definitely it's beautiful. Usually what do you tell your uh, uh, travelers and tourists when, while you're touring the museum? Uh, of course, the palace is co contains uh, a large number of rooms. Uh, and uh, each room is decorated with different uh, decorations. Uh, uh, we have uh, the, uh, a room decorated in Moroccan style. Uh, which, uh, which have uh, uh, all the ceilings and covers, uh, the walls and the ceiling are covered with mirrors and, uh, and uh, uh, ceram uh, ceramic uh, tiles. Uh, and it, uh, also we have the Levantine room, uh, which, where we have uh, the room, uh, the room is covered, uh, uh, the walls and the ceilings are covered with uh, uh, wood, wood carvings, uh, with uh, colorful uh, floral motifs and geometrical uh, uh, designs. Uh, and we have uh, along the side the verses of Quran and, uh, and the pa passages of poetry. Great. And, and, and um, Ahera, uh, why was the location of the palace uh, um, uh, chosen to be here where it is as, uh, as far as we know? Uh, it's uh, chosen because of the beaut uh, beautiful vegetation uh, and um, uh, including the uh, banyan trees and the Indian uh, rubber trees and the po uh, royal, royal palms and, um, uh, and cedar. Well, Hela, definitely there are so many uh, rooms and halls here. Uh, among so many rooms, which is uh, your favorite that you really enjoy when you're taking your people on tour, entering? Um, of course, uh, the Moroccan room uh, in the residence uh, palace, uh, because it, uh, it ha it, uh, the walls are covered with mirrors and colorful uh, decorations. Uh, and it is uh, so, something strange and not, and not, uh, not uh, regular. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, what about the remarkable belongings of uh, Prince uh, Muhammad uh, Ali? Uh, yes, uh, there, are, there are rare collections. Uh, this contains uh, a, a table um, made out of elephant ears, uh, 1,000 piece of uh, silver uh, service, uh, textiles, clothing, um, medieval manus manu manuscripts, um, mm. uh, uh, clothing, uh, mm. there are also uh, uh, textiles and uh, uh, also oil paintings, there mm. we have oil paintings uh, from uh, Muhammad Ali dynasty and uh, landscape uh, uh, paintings. Uh, we have uh, writing tools uh, and we have also... Uh, uh, what about the scientific collection uh, here at the museum? Uh, there is a uh, there is a map uh, showing uh, showing uh, the hunting locations uh, it was uh, was brought by uh, uh, Prince Muhammad Ali, and there are also two maps uh, in, um, showing uh, each animal the original location of each animal. Yes, well, uh, I'd like to thank you very much, tour guide Helal Gandur. Thank you very much for being with us, and we'll be back after the break, coming from the Manial Palace. So stay with us. Thank you for your invitation. Thank you, Helal. Thank you.